Hey everybody, it's me, your girl, Dr. Marcella Wilson, and welcome to Pop Tech, where we discuss the intersection of pop culture and technology. Today, we'll be discussing the top three trending Twitter topics. Stick around, you don't want to miss it. Our app of the day is called Indispensable, and we're going to be counting down the top five trending Twitter topics. More restaurants are using iPads to place and take your order. Let's go. All right, everybody, welcome back. I'm Dr. Marcella Wilson, and let's talk about the top three trending Twitter topics. All right. Number three this week is AMC movie theaters. Now, I don't know about you, but I love going to movies. I am a diehard movie fan. Don't mess with my movie experience, okay? I need to get there early so I can get a seat in the back, in the middle, right? I need to get my popcorn. And it's even better if it's one of those theaters where, you know, you can recline and put your feet up. Ooh, ooh. Well, anyway, I'm getting off on a tangent. Anyway, AMC Movie Theaters announced that they were planning on having sections of their movie theaters that would allow texting during the movie. This caused the Twitter universe to just explode, blow up you ate. People were just so upset and tweeting angry, mean tweets like, how can this be possible? So much so that AMC Movie Theaters sent out a statement today, actually, backtracking and saying that they will not allow or they're not considering and they're not planning on putting a section in their movie theaters that would allow texting during the movie. I mean, when you really think about it, if you need to text all throughout the movie, why are you at the movies, right? Yeah, just a thought. All right. Let's talk about the number two trending Twitter topic for this week, and that is the hashtag Jackie Robinson Day. Today is actually Jackie Robinson Day. Now, I'll be honest. I am not a baseball girl. I don't know a lot about baseball. And obviously, of course, I've heard about Jackie, Jackie Robinson and how amazing he was in baseball. But I did not know how much of a figure an important person he was in the civil rights movement. Did you know that the contract that he signed with the New York Dodgers is considered by many to be the founding document of the civil rights movement? That is so huge and so powerful. Him as a black man being signed to the New York Dodgers at that time was groundbreaking, revolutionary, and never have been done before. Jackie Robinson, we so appreciate your athletic skills and what you did for the civil rights movement. You are iconic. And if you don't know, read up about him. Um, go see his movie, read the books about him, and just learn a little about him and all that he's done for black history. Thank you so much, Jackie Robinson. We appreciate you. All right, let's go to the number one trending Twitter topic for this week, and it is Mamba Day. So if you are a sports fan, or if you've been living under a rock, Wednesday, Kobe Bryant closed out his illustrious 20-year NBA career with the Los Angeles Lakers. He dropped 60 and won the game and everybody was there in attendance to watch him play his very very last game for the NBA. Snoop Dogg was there, David Beckham was there, Adam Levine, um, just a whole slew of um, Jack Nicholson. Everybody was there to say goodbye to Kobe and just to thank him for just being so great and providing us such great sports entertainment. Everybody 
was tweeting out congratulations and thanks and old pictures and old clips. It was amazing. So Mama Day is the number one trending Twitter topic of this week. All right, guys, that's all I've got for you today. Catch me next week, and I'm going to be talking about what goes down in the DM. All right, you don't want to miss that. All right, I'm Dr. Marcella Wilson. I'm out. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe. <laughs> Bye, guys. You've been great. Bye.